but a cure is indeed possible and scientists need to keep working to find a cure. Um, inside of an epidemic that's claimed tens of millions and in people living with HIV. This is such new territory that we cannot be certain until some years per it is not an answer. It's, it's very promising and you know from the scientific report it seems very likely that this single individual. It's particularly notable because she's uh, the first woman who's uh, achieved a long-term remission of HIV, and it's particularly important because worldwide women uh, constitute over half of people living with HIV. We always are a bit cautious in this setting because this kind of intervention, a bone marrow transplant, would not be appropriate for people living with HIV. This woman received a bone marrow transplant because she also had a blood cancer that needed to be treated. Is cured, but the appropriate thing is to speak of remission until more time has passed and we understand. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.